you found me at Dingo with the legend Greg Minnow. Now, if you've been living under a rock for the last 20 years and you don't know who this man is, have a look at this. What is We at Pezulu Crocodile Sanctuary, and as you can see behind me, these are slender studded crocodiles from North Africa, critically endangered, and we're all about conservation here. So we're about trying to breed these species so that there are more of them in the world. Another aspect of the sanctuary is rehabilitation. And the half jaw here, he came in when he was just a little boy. And as you can see, he's lost half his upper jaw. Now he can never be released into the wild because he won't be able to feed himself. Greg's here today to help us with Rosie. That's half jaw's girl. Make sure she's in perfect health for breeding. Now you've got to understand, these crocodiles, they're not timid little things. These guys are tougher than woodpecker lips. I mean, you're not going to hurt this croc. If anything, the croc's going to hurt you. <laughs> Tell you, we have to be so careful. We have to get a jaw, a jaw rope on her to secure those jaws. Otherwise, she hurts herself and she's gonna bite us. <laughs> what we need to do now is as we say go, you're gonna jump on that thing. I'm gonna go for the head, I'm gonna close those eyes because when the eyes are closed, they're more calm. You're gonna go for the back of the legs, and you're gonna lift those legs up off the ground because if that crocodile's got traction on the ground, we're in real trouble. Then once we've got it pinned down correctly, we'll keep those jaws nice and secure, then we've got to measure. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Secure Rosie. Greg, how was that? How you feeling? Quite calm? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta measure up now and get her out. That means she's just three centimeters off breeding age, which means just in a couple of months time we can put her with half jaw and have beautiful baby crocodiles coming from the two of it. Isn't that a wonderful conservation story? Story of rehabilitation. It's such a beautiful animal when you're so close to it and you, uh, you can feel it breathing underneath you and, and uh, it's an incredible experience and just amazing to be a part of a program like this where they, they're able to rehabilitate and, and get young juveniles back into the wild. Greg, thanks for joining us today, helping us out with the crocs. Absolutely wonderful. You're a star champion. Thanks, Dinga. Dinga.